I'll be test driving a Tesla Model X as soon as my nearby Tesla store gets one in stock. Um, the Tesla Model X is basically built on the exact same platform as the Tesla Model S with only a few minor tweaks for ride quality. And um, the thing about it is it looks like it's going to be a really great SUV along the lines of the BMW X series because in my opinion it looks better than the BMW X. Now the only problem is in order to actually own an electric vehicle you have to have a garage, you have to have some place that can charge it. So if you have an office building you got to have some kind of extension cable and you need a place where you can charge without having to worry about the cable being pulled out. The Tesla Model S car is really cool. The only problem is my clients a lot of them haven't been interested in it because, you know, everybody has the same reason. It's like you can go anywhere and get gas, but you can't simply recharge anywhere. In certain cases, this is the truth. In certain cases, it's not. Hopefully, down the road, Tesla may, you know, include a Chevy Volt-like range-extending motor that uses gasoline to generate electricity for the batteries. And hopefully... Tesla doesn't have problems like Boeing's currently having and like Fisker Karma has had where their, you know, the lithium ion batteries are overheating and uh, causing, you know, fires and everything. Because until battery technology gets a lot better, these vehicles aren't going to be completely trustworthy. But um, only time will tell. Hopefully battery technology will get better. But uh, look forward to my Tesla Model X review, and for right now, you can watch my Tesla Model S review just to see what I thought about that car.